Good morning, everyone, and welcome. This is a Thrifty Thursday. So I'm going to show you, before we go to the thrift store, I'm going to show you today a few things I got in the mail for myself, and then we will have the Thrifty Thursday. And also I want to show you something that Nancy gave me. So I got this book on eBay, and it's called The Country Store, Old Remedies, Recipes, and Advertisements. Now, it is just a booklet, but there's all kinds of neat ideas in here. And this would have been back at like the country store. Well, here is the theme that I'm working on. I always work on different projects and I'm going to be showing you if I didn't yet, I am redoing all of my pantries and I'm turning them into a country store. I have my own very own country store in my home. So I got this book to get some ideas of what the country store was like. And you know, like Little House on the Prairie and the Olsons and their mercantile store. So this is gonna be so much fun for me because I have a lot of different things that I wanna do with all of it. So I did get this book. And then I got this. Now I'm not too happy because the print is so small. So I'm going to have to, I have to wear my glasses when I read now, but I was hoping it was a bigger print but I did get the Martyr's Mirror. And as I told you, I am doing some research and studying on this. So I bought this on eBay as well. I'm gonna look to see if they have the large print. That's so much easier for me to read. Okay, Nancy gave me some two magazines because she's been giving me, when she's done with her magazine, she's been giving them to me because I don't have these. Mother Earth News, I can't wait to read that. And she gave me these. Like this is really neat. I have never had store-bought bees wax. And this is neat, bees wrap. I just think it's so cute. Look how beautiful they are and old fashioned looking. So I'm gonna open one up. <gasps> Take a look at that, isn't that gorgeous? Oh my goodness, that is so neat. Okay, so this reminds me. <laughs> Jerry Landers, and she has Hopalong Hollow. She's a friend of mine, and she just put out a video, and she was making these, these little wooden things, and then she used rubber stamping. I've never had rubber stamps. I've never done rubber stamping, but I'm excited because I want to do some rubber stamping because I seen her video, and I thought it would be so much fun, and this reminded me of it. So I like to get these little wooden buttons, and I would like to make my own. She was making them for plant markers, but I think all the fun things that I could do with it. So I wanna see if the thrift store has any rubber stamps. So I will be showing you here in a moment when I get back. But take a look at this. They're almost so pretty, you don't wanna use them. But this is the beeswax wrap. And I absolutely love them. Really, really neat. I'm trying to take it apart. Oh, it smells, I love the smell of beeswax. I know I'm really silly, but I absolutely love that. I wanna do this. I wanna do this with mine. That is so cool. So I'm gonna see if I can find some rubber stamps today. If not, I can get them on Amazon. I think they're for fairly cheap, but we'll see if I can find some. So thank you so much, Nancy. This is so neat. I'm not opening the other ones up. I just think they're so pretty. They're almost too pretty to open up and use them. Look at this one. Isn't that so neat? All right, everyone. We're gonna go ahead, put this stuff away, and then I'm going to the thrift store, and then we'll see what I come back with. And this is a brand new home that is an Amish home, built with solar.
All right, I have to show you something really funny. I had this as a product review. <laughs> it, it's a purse. It's a chicken purse. Hubby's like, you are not going to be using that. You're not going to be taking that in the thrift store. It's a chicken purse. <laughs> I tell you the stuff, the stuff that they come up with. No, I am not going to be using this in the thrift store. Now, my question to all of you is, would you be seen with the chicken purse? Would you go to town and go shopping at the grocery store with your chicken purse? Let me know in the comments below. Are you brave enough to wear the chicken? <laughs> I'll be honest with you, I am not brave enough to be sporting the chicken. Can you see me in my Am Amishy dresses with the chicken yet? Now I know I'm eccentric, but can you see me with the bandana, my Amishy looking outfits, and then the chicken? <laughs> I think hubby would disown me if I would do all of that. Give me 96 jars. I have all of these cases of jars. She gave me all of these. She gave me locking lid containers and jar lids. Now these were items that she had and she no longer was going to use them and she wanted to send them to me. These are egg cartons. Thank you so much, Wanda. You know I will put these to use probably in the next week or two. I went through all of my canned foods and what I need to can is corn and I need to can chicken broth. I'm going to be using these jars to can all that. So Wanda, thank you so much for all these beautiful, lovely items. They are gonna be great in my food storage and I really wanna thank you. I have the kindest, most loving friends and supporters on my channel and I just want to thank you from the bottom of my heart that, you know, she could have easily donated these but she wanted to donate them to me and I really want to thank her so much for that and I just am so appreciative of it. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Alright everyone, I'm going to show you what I got this week at the thrift store. Alright, so I want to show you what I got at the thrift store. For one dollar, I got all of these bags. I love these. Now, I don't know if they're good for you or not, but I love these forever bags. They do keep the produce fresher, and I've had bags like these now for many years, but for one dollar, it's all these. So it's the bread one, produce one. I don't know much about them other than they do really work. So I got that for a dollar. And then I got this fabric for $2 because I need to work on a project and I need to cut these out and these are going to actually be a cleaning supply kit that I'm making. And I thought they're just adorable. So I paid $2 for this material. I'm actually going to be working on that right away. And then we got our stampers. So this is what we got. Stampers are expensive online, but I got them really cheap. So we got for 50 cents, we got the bird. 50 cents, we got the flower. And then for 25 cents, we got this little flower. I've never used stampers before. I've never stamped things, but I just thought it was so much fun when I saw um, Hop Along Hollow. And now, okay, I'm into something else. <laughs> You know, it's you're never too old to learn collect things, but I know I love dolls yet, but I'm, you know, being careful about that and I'm into this. So if you would have seen the last week's Thrifty Thursday, I had something like this. I'm into this and this here looks to me like lettuce leaves. I don't think it's a cabbage, but I just absolutely love it. I did pay $4.99. I love the food porcelain, the food ceramics that look like food. It goes so well with my Peter Rabbit. And I'm gonna have to have a house tour because you won't believe how I decorated. I'm really working on some things. But I got this for $4.99. That was a little much, but I, I just love it. And they're pieces that I'm going to keep. 
All right, so that was it at the thrift store. And then we went to the Dollar General. I always say it wrong, I always say Family Dollar, but this is the Dollar General. And I was hoping that I could get some of the stamp pads. Now these are really, really small. This is all they had. So this is all I could find, but I did get some stamp pads. I got some labels like this. And then I got these little clothespins because we're, I'm gonna make some labels with this. I know, it's so much fun. Learning all kinds of new skills and hobbies. It's a lot of fun. And these were three, four, and five for five dollars. And then my stampers. And I'm gonna be making some things with that. Well, everyone, I hope you enjoyed my thrifty Thursday. And I can't wait to share with you again tomorrow what we're doing. Bye, everybody. Oh, by the way, this is probably the first video in a very long time that it was the full video that I'm not wearing a bandana. <laughs> it's a little something to get used to, I know. <laughs> Bye, everybody.